Here is the summary of what I think I learned and a little info on each color. There are many different species of sea moss. And while they all have many similarities, they also have a few differences. For the most part, all sea moss is very nutrient dense. They all contain roughly 92 of the 102 vitamins and minerals that our bodies require to function and will all yield many of the same positive health benefits. A difference in this area is that different species of moss contain varying amounts of some of those nutrients, thus making some species of moss better for specific conditions. Different species of sea moss grow in different water conditions in different parts of the world. Most of these are off the Atlantic coastlines of North America, Europe, and the Caribbean islands. There are a few factors that I was able to find to help explain the natural variants in color. First let's talk about phytonutrients. In an effort to spare you the agony of reading the five-paragraph essay that I just wrote trying to explain it to you, I deleted it and will try to summarize it the best I can in a few sentences. Phytonutrients or phytochemicals are basically chemicals produced by plants that help them stay healthy by protecting them from things like insect attacks and the sun. They are also the pigments that gives fresh foods their bright colors. Phytonutrients are significantly beneficial for humans who eat them but are not considered nutrients that are essential for life, like carbs, fats, protein, vitamins, and minerals. Among the benefits of phytonutrients are powerful antioxidant properties and anti-inflammatory activities, enhanced immunity and intercellular communication, basically meaning they help our cells talk to each other. These few things alone can be profound for our health. So why am I talking about phytonutrients? Well, because they play a role in the different benefits received from different species of sea moss. Purple phytonutrients are powerful antioxidants called anthocyanins thought to delay cellular aging and help the heart by blocking the formation of blood clots. They support cognitive, cardiovascular, and liver health. Gold, yellow, phytonutrients carry anti-inflammatory properties, assist in cell communication, and promote cognitive, cardiovascular, vision, skin and vascular health. Okay, now back to the moss part. Purple SEA moss scientifically known as Gracilaria is a species of red algae, Rhodophyta, noted as one of the most nutrient and mineral-rich food on the planet. It is my understanding that the distance from the shore and the depth that the moss grows play a role in both the nutrient content and depth of color hues the moss retains. The deeper and farther from the shore the moss grows, the more nutrients it has and darker color it is. An interesting difference to note is that all purple sea moss comes out the sea purple. The same cannot be said for all gold sea moss. Most people consider all gold sea moss, and sometimes all sea moss, Irish moss, but this isn't actually true. True Irish moss, Condors crispus, grows in cold water, usually off the coasts of Ireland and Scotland. Some of the species of gold sea moss that is readily available to us in the U.S. come from the Caribbean Sea, and it comes out purple. It isn't until the sun-drying process that the color pigments are naturally drawn out. In some cases of sea moss from China and other countries, the moss is chemically bleached. Now repeat after me. No to bleached moss. Just a little research will help you determine when sea moss is fake, pool-grown, or chemically bleached. Purple sea moss health benefits are numerous. It can improve our immunity and fight off a cold, sore throat, fever, free radicals and infection because of its rich antiviral properties. Additionally, it is an excellent source of calcium and sulfur-based amino acids that can strengthen bones. Gold sea moss promotes gut health, helps with inflammation, eliminates mucus from the body, but so does purple, increases blood flow helps convert food into energy and helps with muscle and joint pain. Are you confused that what is different between green sea moss and purple sea moss or gold sea moss? Then you're on the right page. We're going to cover everything about purple sea moss, gold sea moss and green sea moss. Chondrus crispus is the scientific name of sea moss, commonly called Irish moss, carrageen moss or main coast sea moss. It is a species of red algae which grows abundantly along the rocky parts of the Atlantic coast of Europe and North America. There are a lot of sea moss available in the market like purple sea moss, green sea moss, 
golden sea moss, and even black sea moss. Golden sea moss, it is the most common sea moss you can on different platform. Golden sea moss contains all the benefits of sea moss. It is also known as Caribbean sea moss. It's depend on you which sea moss you like, but it has very minimal smell and taste compared to the other colors. Purple sea moss, purple sea moss contains powerful antioxidants called anthocyanins, which are commonly found in blue and purple fruits or vegetables. Anthocyanins are linked to health benefits such as stronger bones, a healthier heart, lower inflammation and protection against certain types of cancers. Purple sea moss is more rare to find and dried in a dark room to avoid losing its unique color and benefits. We offer the highest quality of purple sea moss. Our Irish sea moss is a 100% real and wild crafted from Maine. Green sea moss, green sea moss is the more rare to find. Green sea moss has chlorophyll, which is widely known as the life force of the plants and is what gives it color. Green sea moss is also known for natural body deodorizer and detoxifier.